there, it's Anna. And I get asked this question a lot, so I thought I'd share um, where the dragonfly name came from. So when I was a little girl, my dad used to take me fishing. Uh, and it was one of my favorite things to do with my dad. He would back up all yellow. That's his um, big yellow truck. <laughs> uh, back it right up to the pond. And it wouldn't... It wouldn't be anybody but just me and dad or fishing poles. If I was lucky, a folded in half peanut butter and banana sandwich and um, the tall grass, the hungry bass, and of course, snake doctors. Um, and he would always tell me when we're fishing, I would see these big bugs that were flying around the pond and he'd say hey be careful those are snake doctors and where there is a snake doctor there is a snake and that was his way of warning me about snakes which is true where there are dragonflies there are usually snakes because dragonflies hang out around water usually um and so um i was always fascinated by dragonflies i always thought they were really cool and <laughs> there's iris She's trying to come out. <laughs> so whenever I see dragonflies, I always think of my dad. Um, my dad passed away in 2008, a year before my uh, oldest son was born. And uh, so <clears throat> every time I see a dragonfly, I always think of him. And <laughs> I got to where I, um, everywhere I'd go, I'd always see I'd always see dragonflies. They would just follow me around, um, often chasing me, uh, even my car, I, even in a metropolis area, like uh, in a parking lot uh, in the middle of the city. Um, I often found that dragonflies just were everywhere. And I don't know if I just noticed them more or if they just followed me. And I told my mom about it and she said, oh, that's just your dad. He's just saying hello. Or this is just God. Um, Reminding you of your dad. And so, uh, probably, I guess it's been over a year, I uh, got a tattoo on my shoulder of a dragonfly to kind of commemorate my dad and to kind of remind me of my dad. So, whenever the opportunity came about to buy a building, um, we purchased the building and we we're trying to think of a name for the studio. And we tried, oh, Hometown Fitness, nah. Tater Town Fitness, nah. And so mom was like, Dragonfly Fitness Studio. And I was like, yeah, that's perfect. So that's really where the Dragonfly came from. Um, and after I looked it up, you know, dragonflies are a cool little insect. They um, are kind of mythical creatures in um, other uh, cultures. And... Um, they signify transformation, and I do feel like that that's what we do at the studio. I feel like we help people learn to love themselves and transform not just their bodies, but their mind and their spirit. Um, and dragonflies, just like a lot of other insects, but dragonflies particularly start out in the water as a water-dwelling insect and then they fly and I think that is so cool that they start from the water and then they fly and they are very beautiful insects um and they're just they're really cool looking and I just I've always had a thing for dragonflies so that's where it comes from